Sorry, mind you Sorry, mister. My yeah. mistake. Please! No. Oh, you bastard! Oh, you bastard! Suap hari kali. Nak mana awak tadi jadi? Gentel, gentel. Berani ya jadi ni. Bonjour. Dear boy. Yes, here I am. Well, we're going to need to get you smartened up a bit. Why? Well, you can't play at the tables on a Lanahasi River boat looking like this. Yeah? Not if you want to fit in so well that no one will realize you're there to rob the place. Now, come on. Are we still doing that? <laughs> of course. We're going to fix you up so fine no one will notice a thing. Hello. Can I help you, gentlemen? Yes, my friend here is in need of a new suit. We are playing on the riverboat this evening. Excellent. Well, you'll find all my inventory in the catalog here. Make this gentleman look like the Duke he really is. It was the English's fault his grandfather had to emigrate. A bitter and jealous people. You can see the aristocrat in his profile. The heavy brow. Okay. Come on, let's get you to the barber. Sure. Good luck tonight, gentlemen. Herr Strauss has scoped the whole thing out. It's quite ingenious, actually. What is? The action he has planned. Indeed, it's not much of an action at all. You play cards and win. And you're going to bet very big and flamboyantly while you win. And everyone's going to think you're some new money from the oil fields come to lay it on thick and drunk. All the while, Herr Strauss will be signaling you in your line of thought. When you bust the place, they'll take you upstairs to pay you off. And that is when Javier comes in, and you take whatever you want. You don't think they might see an armed Mexican coming into the safe with me? Sure, they might, but perhaps not. You will see. The suspense is killing me. Oh, don't be so jaded. We both know this is just the kind of innocent fun you thrive on. Well, I thought I Arm robbery don't seem such an innocent pastime. No, but we, you, all of us, will be done here soon. I hope so. Come on. fellow has made himself a fortune in the oil fields and learned himself not a lick of manners or gentlemanly deportment well very good sir no it's not good not good at all not if they're going to let him play big at the tables tonight Make 
make him look like a prince, sir. Sabar, sabar. Style, style rambut dulu. Ooh, baby. Sebelas model rambut nih. Satu. Kurang ganteng, gak ada jenggotnya. There, very smart. Come on, let's get to the box. I've arranged some transportation for us. Yeah. So, 
If Strauss is sitting behind him, how does he know what cards I got? He what won't. Cards but the dealer has recently become a very good friend of mine. Another one. Don't worry, Arthur. We're all the authors of our own good fortune. He'll make sure you get the right cards. What could possibly go wrong? <clears throat> Indeed. And what money am I playing with? Don't worry. That has all been arranged. Your chips will be waiting for you. Your chip. Is the sort of Judy get any? Judy. Come on. Okay. Arthur, even you weapon be here. We are searchers when we get on. George, we'll collect these from you later. Very good, sir. Thank you, George. Good luck, sir. Now remember what I said, Arthur. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Yes, yes, believe me, I heard every word. Watch Strauss, listen to the dealer, and this should be a very lucky night. There they are. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you. Arthur, you remember this pair of boys we met in New York? Wow. Come on. Champagne is on dear old Arthur. He's rich as can be and feeling luckier than a turkey that survived Thanksgiving. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, gentlemen. Gunting, gunting, semua orang ini. Come on, come on, let's head aboard. Drinks on Arthur. Champagne. I'm afraid we require all patrons to hand over their guns. Good time. The table's away. Okay, I'll champion. go find myself a change of clothes. Okay. You seem unsure. Robbing a heavily armed riverboat without a gun tends to bring out the self-doubt in me. These people are virtually idiots. This is simple stuff. Now have a good time, but don't lose too much money or your wife is going to kill me. Whatever you say. Now where can I get a car? Feel free to join a game, sir. Are you joining us? Good evening, gentlemen. Arthur Callahan. Sorry, I'm late. I had some uh, unfinished business at the bar. Hey, Desmond yeah. Blythe. Good evening. Not to worry. Welcome to the game, Mr. Callahan. Okay, gentlemen, let's play. I hope you're a player. Been too many cowards at these tables recently. Nothing less dignified than a man afraid to lose a little money. Look at this! Chips already stacked up, waiting for me. I like this joint already. We aim to please, sir. So, how are we all fair? Some better than others. If we all fared the same in life now, where would the fun be? Quiet. Ma Wait, not Desmond Blythe, the hosiery king. I should have brought my other wallet. Not my preferred title, but... Yes, you should have. Mana instruksi kita? Are you playing? You know what? Here we go then. Oh my, Hello, my. my ladies. Damn it. Mr. Blythe wins with three queens. <laughs> Goodbye, gentlemen. I guess it's just you and me now, friend. Yes, it is. Time to see if you're really the man you seem to think you are. Likewise, Mr. Blythe. So, what business are you in, Mr. Callahan? I'm an oil man, for my sins. Funny, I haven't heard of you. Oh, you will. You know, I thought about getting in a hosiery, but... I just look better in a suit. 
I would stick to Hoyle, Mr. Callahan. I don't think you have a future on the stage. You sound just like my wife. Whenever you're ready, sir. Sabardolo. Call. Okay, Mr. Callahan, I'm all in. All in. All in to Kalakita. I'm all in. Interesting. Pair of cowgirls. Shit. Shit. I guess my luck hell. Is that you done? Done. Bust. All right, you got something else to play with. Meaning... Well, I heard... Well, I heard there were some big boys on this boat. Maybe that's not you. No offense. Sit your hillbilly ass down. Why? I got a watch. Look at you. An expensive one. Real fine. Swiss. A Reutlinger, no less. It's in the safe upstairs. It's worth more than you. Okay. I just... Now play. As you wish. So, you must know Leviticus Cornwall, big oil man like you. Of course, we've crossed paths. I was fortunate enough to tour a little operation heads up in New Hanover. King King Law. <laughs> I am 100% all in, Mr. Callahan. Don't worry, sir. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Is gonna be a long game. Oh, yep. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Pair kings. Very good, but not good enough. Shit. Bah. Uh -oh. bah, 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 bah. Yes, you little beauty. Hard lines, Mr. Blythe. Mr. Callahan wins with an ace high diamond flush. God damn you! No offense. Well played, sir. Unlucky, Desmond. Now, forgive my lack of discretion, but uh, where might I find this watch? It's upstairs. Shall we go and have a look? Why not? Gentlemen, please, cash these out for me. I started last week. Good. Sure. Perhaps you could escort us up to the office. Yes, of course, sir. Thank you. Follow me, gentlemen. Come with me, sir. You're having quite the night. Yeah, so far. I cannot believe someone gave a greaser a joke. We live in strange times. Personally, I wouldn't trust one with a gun, but you know, I've got my own little lawgiver right here. Very good. Next, we'll be hiring Negroes. Yeah, I know, I know. I think you're going to like this watch, sir. I saw it earlier, and it really is a handsome piece. Foreign made, but you can't have everything. You can't Maybe. have everything. Well, here we are. Just give me one second, sir. Of course, take your time. <laughs> Don't reach for that gun. Take his gun, Arthur. Get his gun. Go on. I guess you were right. Only an idiot would give a greaser a gun. Look, Seth. Idiot, huh? Anjir, di 
kapal. You in here is looking pretty good. How much is there? Must be a few thousand plus the watch. Nice. Now let's get out of here. Come on. Let's go meet the others. Sure. And we've only got a few minutes to get out of here. If we're lucky. Monkey Tony. Shot. Sounded like one. Come on. And how exactly are we getting out of here? I ain't too sure. This is what tends to happen when you leave Trelawney in charge of planning. Oh, garnish no meat. Probably involve us dressing up as dancing girls, can cannon off the side. Nice uniform, by the way. Thanks. Give anyone a job these days. Anyway, we shouldn't give ourselves away till we know we need to. Maybe we could still blend into the crowd when it all goes crazy. Which it surely will. To the bar, senor! You had fun, sir. <laughs> At the time of my life. You boys sure know how to put on a show. <laughs> That's wonderful. Ah, <laughs> uh, look. There's your friend. He's not a no cheat, and I beg you to take back the insinuation. There he is. Now, don't be a sore loser, friend. There's something I don't like about the pair of you. There's plenty I don't like about you, but I have the good manners to keep my mouth shut. There he is. Shoot that man. Ah! What, what, what? Well, never a dull moment. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. So, how much did we get? A few thousand, I think. Pretty good. Yes, indeed. And this watch. Uh, apparently it's worth a bunch of Swiss. A Reutlinger or something? Nice watch. Yes, it's a right lingo, all right. <laughs> we'll give it back then. All right, come on, let's get out of here. Thank you. 